Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title, today's video is going to be about my teeth. Here is a before and after. I'm basically going to be showing you guys um, what my teeth look like before, why I didn't like them, and then what I did to change them and get the current teeth and smile I have now. This was about two years ago. So I don't, I don't remember the whole thing exactly, but I just got it done for a second time, which I'll get into that, but I just got it done a second time like two weeks ago, which made me want to make this video in the first place. I don't really think that there's any other thing I need to say in the introduction, so I'm just going to get into it. Okay, so I'm going to insert some pictures, I don't know where, on the screen of um, my old teeth and what they used to look like before. as you can see i just had a really gummy smile before like small teeth baby teeth um it's basically because i had a really gummy smile so my gums came down like a lot lower than like a normal person's would the thing about like my small teeth mostly that i just really did not appreciate was that it made me look so much younger because like i said they looked like baby teeth so like anytime i smiled i just looked really young so i asked my orthodontist the one that did my invisalign um like how can i fix this and he said that people who want to fix that basically get their gums lasered off my procedure that i did is a little bit different than that but it's pretty much the same process so i didn't know what to do and so luckily my uncle is a dentist shout out to dr mindy brindawa he is a dentist in the roseville area so you guys, he's the best in the game. Feel free to hit him up. But yeah, he recommended to me um, his friend who is a periodontist. And he was like, you should get um, periodontal surgery. I think that's what it's called. Let me make sure. Periodontal surgery. It's also known as gum surgery. So yeah, um, so he referred me to his friend. So oh, his name is Dr. Khalid Rashid and he is a very good periodontal doctor. Yeah, he was super nice. Shout out to him. And so me and my mom booked a consultation to go see him. I didn't know how to tell my parents. Like, I had just been complaining about my teeth for so long and my parents for the longest time they're like ashley your teeth are fine like we don't see anything wrong with them like they're fine you don't need the surgery like blah, blah 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 but i don't know my mom just like saw how unhappy i was like literally anytime i laughed even i would like cover my mouth when i laughed or, like in pictures i would not smile my full smile because like if i smiled my full smile you mostly saw gums and just like little little teeth so she noticed that and she listened to me even though she didn't think at the time that I needed it. She was just like, okay, like if it's what you want, we can go. So then me and my mom booked a consultation to see Dr. Rashid and um, he was really nice. He explained to me like um, what the surgery is, what he's going to do. So what he ended up doing is cutting my gums. He did these first four teeth because they were like small how the surgery went is he numbed me with the shot in my gums um it wasn't too bad it didn't hurt too bad i couldn't feel pretty much any of my gums um also my nose i couldn't feel my nose for some reason and then for the surgery i just felt like i could hear basically i couldn't really feel my gums at all but i could hear like I could hear like scratching on my teeth of him like taking off the gums, but I couldn't feel anything. Like obviously I felt it on my tooth, but like it didn't hurt. Like they can't numb the teeth. You just feel scratching. So it was fine. And um, I think I was bleeding a lot, you know, like as you would when you cut your gums off. And then they just put some stitches in my teeth. So yeah, I got it done. I loved my teeth. Everything was great, but it was such a big difference that I was just like, oh my God, this is great. This is great. This is great. And so I went on for two years and I loved it and I, I still love it. And then I realized like, oh, maybe maybe I did need to go a little bit more. And my mom was saying the same thing. Yeah, you can just a little bit more because like still when I smiled, you could still see a little bit of gum and I just didn't like it. I, just, I was like, you know what? 
I, I want to be happy. So we went back to him and he was so nice. He completely understood. He, he looked at my teeth and he was like, yeah, I see one tooth. We could definitely go in on and make a little bit bigger. He was very, this is what I liked about him. He was very, very honest, very trustworthy. He told me I don't need to go more on these two because um, something about like symmetry. He was like, these teeth aren't even supposed to be bigger than the front two teeth. He's like, you're not going to like me if I do that to you. So then I'll insert another before and after. But yeah, I'm really, really thankful to him for doing that. He could have been like, no, but he did it for me again, free of charge. And that was just very nice of him. And I'm very appreciative because I'm very, very happy with my smile now. And yeah. Okay, so now I'll get into pricing. Um, Keep in mind, these are my price. Like these are the prices I paid. I'm not sure um if you go somewhere else how much it would be i'm not sure if they would do it the same way i'm not sure what they would include but for me this is how much it was so i went to a place called capital periodontal and they have like offices around sacramento i tried to look see if they have an instagram but i couldn't find one then again this is in la or anything like doctors here don't have crazy instagrams about like all their clients and stuff like that so if i remember correctly from the first time i got it done it was around two thousand dollars so i think that's like five hundred dollars per tooth um i did pay for it myself my parents did help me but in my household we don't get handed whatever we want and i was a working woman so my parents were like you wanted this it's a cosmetic surgery you can pay for it we'll help you but you can pay for it so now i want to get into uh like the aftermath of the surgery like pain and all that other stuff i don't think that i bought any antibiotics or painkillers or anything like that um i know this time i didn't this time I, I didn't i just dealt with it it's not that bad okay so for me i have a pretty high pain tolerance i don't even know why but for me the pain really wasn't that bad i they gave me an ice pack as soon as after the surgery was done just to ice it yeah, so I just iced it the whole car ride home. At night, it didn't feel like anything. The next few days, there's like a little bit of discomfort, but it literally feels like a pizza burn. Like, you know when you bite into a pizza that's too hot and like the roof of your mouth kind of hurts and like, you know, it just, it just stings a little bit or burns for like however long. That's how bad it feels, but like just for a few days. And like, it's a pain that's like so little, at least to me, that like I forgot about it. That every now and then I'd remember and be like, oh, that kind of, that's kind of annoying, that kind of hurts, but like, that's it. But what I feel like I should mention is the day after I, I got it done, I woke up and my teeth were back to their original size. So they were really small and I was really bloody and I was like freaking out. I was like, oh my God, like my gums are broken or something. Like they just wanted, they, my teeth just want to be this small. My gums are going to keep growing back. The surgery doesn't, didn't work. Like I was freaking out. I was panicking. So I texted my uncle and I texted him a picture of everything. He was like, don't worry. They're just swollen uh it's gonna peel you'll be fine it, it's gonna go back to how it looked after the surgery because it they my teeth looked really big after the surgery um and so over the next few days like your gums right here are like like a pale like yellow color like what in the part that they cut and they kind of peel or like maybe i was just peeling them i don't know but i would like go like this and it would like come off i'm really not sure if i was supposed to do that i wasn't going crazy with it but like I would see some and just be like, okay, let me just. Yeah, so that's what happens. And then over the next couple days, I'd say the only annoying part about it is that the stitches like show a little bit. They're very thin, but they are like a blue color. Okay, for me, for me in my doctor's office that I went to, they're thin and they're blue color. So like a dark blue, almost black. So it looks like you have like hair stuck in your teeth. And that's kind of annoying, but like, I don't know i got it done both times during like break like uh thanksgiving break winter break so i didn't really have to see anybody anyway i'm probably gonna insert some um videos of the stitches that i took like a few days ago um just because i want to show you guys kind of what they look like I actually just had my appointment to get my stitches removed this morning. I just got my stitches out, so they now... And 
um the doctor said that they're not done healing yet even still yeah so i will show you i am very appreciative of dr rashid for doing this for doing it a second time he was a great doctor if you're in the area of sacramento roseville elk grove if you're interested you know in this you guys should definitely check him out and yeah um, and then also i just wanted to say i didn't make this video to like make anyone like be self-conscious of their teeth if you have small teeth i know plenty of people who have like smaller teeth and their smiles are like so pretty and i'm being honest i'm being genuine i just think the shape of my teeth was so like some of them were rectangles some of them were more square like it was just so like it went like this like my teeth went like this and honestly at the end of the day a lot of people couldn't tell a lot of people didn't even notice that i got it done it was just something that i wanted to do something that i had the means to do and so i was like i was like whatever yeah thank you guys for watching this video um if you have any more questions for me feel free to leave them down in the comment box and yeah i hope that this was informative for whoever cared or if you didn't care and you like your teeth and you're just watching this for fun then thank you i appreciate you <laughs> but yeah make sure that you like comment and subscribe bye you become a that I keep on talking